Welcome back to the channel, Getting It Done. Getting It Done Fishing. And we're gonna get it done today because we're gonna be talking about, I know this may be a little controversial uh, video. It may not be like in the wheelhouse of what we talk about, but we're gonna talk about the one brand or the one, you know, we, we talked about if you only had one brand of fish, which, which one would it be? It might not be your favorite one. It's just which brand would you pick if you can only fish one from beginning of the season to the end of the season. And now I wanna talk about what brand do you dislike the most? You know, I, I don't really, I'm not a kind of negative guy. I don't like to throw a lot of negative stuff out there. And, you know, again, I don't want to put any companies down or anything like that. But one company, when you're walking through that aisle of a Walmart or a Dick's or a Cabela's or whatever uh, store you're going to, and you just see that brand and you look at it like, I ain't touch, I'm not touching that brand. It doesn't matter what it is. Oh, that lure looks really cool. I'm not touching it. Or maybe you have kids or grandkids or, you know, they say, hey, dad, or hey, you know, grandpa, or whatever the case may be, yeah, I, 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 that, that little works cool. And you're like, I'm not buying that because I don't like the company. So what is that? What, what brand is that? We all have that brand. We all have that brand that we will just not touch with a 10 foot pole. And you know, for me, I, I have one or two brands that I just personally, I've tried, I don't like, and, I, and, and I'll stay away from it. So I'm gonna use the same list that I did for if you only had one brand uh, 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 to fish. And now I'm gonna use the same, there's about 20 or 30 on there, and, and I'll go through it just in case you haven't watched that video. But if you haven't watched it, it's a pretty good video, go, go back and check it out. Again, if you only had one brand or one company to fish all year, which one would it be? Uh, again, go check it out. So same list, I'll just go through. You got Strike King, you got Guggen, you got Z-Man, you got Timu. And again, I, I know Timu, I talked about in the last video, I know Timu is not necessarily a, a fishing company, but I threw it in there because if you, you watch my channel, I do buy a lot from Timu. Um, I do like Timu and I do like a lot of their products, but again, I don't exclusively buy from Timu. I uh, got Berkeley, you got Big Bite uh, Bites, 13 Fishing, Mega Bass, Rapala, Six Sense, Epic, River to Sea, Rooster tail, again, I threw rooster tail in there because of my dad. My dad loved rooster tail. That's all he would fish uh, fish with. So I, I threw that in there. Uh, VNM, uh, Yum, and Zoom. All right, so again, this is one company you're going down the aisle or you're on the internet or you're, you know, you're shopping for, for some baits or some lures and you're going, so I'm just, I'm just not touching that. All right, so for me, let's go right through it. You know, there is quite a bit, you know, when I, when I look for lures, I look for things that work, or I try to get things that work for situations that I fish. And a lot of it's grass, a lot of it's, you know, hydrilla, a lot of it's, you know, cover. Um, I don't, there's only a few, very few ponds that I fish that are kind of wide open and I don't have algae or anything like that. So, you know, when I look for it, you know, when I look for a product, I'm looking for a product that works in my situation. All right, so, you know, for me, a lure, I know a lot of people probably say Timu because they're, they're Chinese and it's like they're, they're tossing out to I am never touching Timu and, and that, that that's great too. There's nothing wrong with them. So it may be Timu. It might be Timu. You might be saying, I'll never, I'll never fish Timu ever. And, and I've got a lot of comments like that and say, hey, yeah, I would never touch that stuff. Hey, so maybe that's the one, maybe that's the one brand or the one company that uses will not touch with a 10 foot pole. All right, so that's cool. So we got that one out of the way. Now I know the ones that a lot of people will probably say, so I'm gonna throw a couple controversial ones in there. And, and I'm gonna tell you the ones that, that I just won't touch. But I know there's, I got a lot of comments on Guggen. I know some people just won't touch Guggen. Now for me, I don't know. <clears throat> I think a lot of their stuff that they have out there um, is I fish pretty much all of their stuff or I've had this stuff over the years. Um, and, and I, yeah. The soft plastics are, are the saucy swimmer. I'll, I'll go with and and there's the soft plastics. I'll, I'll give them credit for the soft plastics. I've used a shaky head, um, so I go with the soft plastics. But I know some people won't touch them. It's just because it's Guggen. Um, that's fine too. Okay, that might be that company out there, right? So you might have Z, uh, Timu and Guggen. Now, when we go through the list, some people just might say, but I think those are probably the two top two. If I put a survey out there, that, that the brands that people won't fish kind of seem like. Probably out of the list, those would be the two. I think all the other companies is kind of like a personal preference. I can't see anybody saying Strike King. I can't see anybody comment below and saying, hey, I, I don't fish Strike King. I'll never fish Strike King. I, I, I don't believe that'd be true. I know Berkeley. If you didn't watch my video, go check out my video. And if somebody says Berkeley, I, I would never fish Berkeley. I would be surprised. I really would because Berkeley has such a wide range of fishing products that it would be kind of tough to put them on that list and say, Ox, Berkeley, I'll never fit. I, 
you know, walking down that aisle, I see Berkeley, I'm, I'm not touching it. All right, Big Bite Baits. I, I've tried their, I've tried their stuff. I just, I don't like it. I, I just, just, I tried a lot of their stuff. I, I, and I'm really disappointed. I still have like, I probably still have a, like bags of their stuff. And I, I try to give it away and, and, and I can't give it away. Nobody wants it. So, you know, that, that's one that I'm gonna put in there. Like, if I seen, if I saw a, a something in Big Bite, uh, Big Bite Baits, and, and I, I'm not touching it, just, I, whew, I'm not touching it, all right? So that's not my top one, though. You know, 13 Fishing, I, I, again, I really don't really buy a lot of stuff from 13 Fishing. I knew, I know they have a lot of good stuff out there. I, I just, not a big fan, and I just really don't buy a lot of stuff from them. All right, Mega Bass, again, it, it's, it's, you know, it's a hit or miss. Rapala, again, I, I know, I, I just know Rapala, it, again, it's going to be one of those things I just don't, just not going to, nobody's going to put it on there. I, I, I refuse to fish Rapala. I just, it's, that's crazy. All right, so Epic Baits, again, I, I know, and I'm just going to pick a couple more out of here, and then we'll go through. You know, Epic Baits, okay, again, that's kind of like uh, Big Bite Baits. It's just, I, I don't know, I probably wouldn't buy it. If I had a Berkeley or... Uh, Epic Baits, what would I buy? I'm gonna, I'm gonna buy Berkeley. It's just what I'm gonna buy. I'm not gonna buy Epic Baits. Okay, so now we're just going through uh, River to Sea. I, I know nobody's gonna say uh, River to Sea because of the Whopper Plopper. And everybody loves Whopper Ploppers. Whopper Ploppers crush them. So I know nobody's gonna put Whopper Plopper or River to Sea in that list. All right, so I'm just gonna go through and, and we'll be, uh, we'll get through this. Rooster Tail, I don't know, <laughs> nobody on this channel. The only reason why I put it on is because my dad fishes it. There's nobody on this channel, there's nobody watching that that's gonna say, wow, I still fish rooster tails. But hey, I threw it on there. If anybody still fishes rooster tails, drop a comment below. All right, so I got Yum and Zoom. Again, I, I don't fish Zoom. For me, I, I, I'm gonna get down to it. There's two companies on here that I will not touch with a 10 foot pole. Uh, and you know, if it was the last company that, that didn't have, if this is the only company I could fish, would I fish them? Sure, I'm not giving up. I'm not gonna give up fishing because, because I don't like the company. I'm just not buying it. All right, so I gotta be honest with you. 13 fishing, I'm sorry, six cents fishing, I, I just don't like them. I, I, I don't know why. I, I honestly don't know why. And I'm sure somebody's gonna say, well, six cents fishing is a lot of good stuff. I They probably do. I, I've never bought a product from six cents ever, 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 ever. Never bought it. Probably will never, ever, 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 ever buy it. I don't know why. I just don't like them. I, I just don't like them. I, I, I don't like them. That and Zoom. I, I got to be honest with you, that and Zoom. Those are the two, those, for me, those are the two companies that no matter what, it, I don't care, any other product that was on the shelf, the same, similar thing, I, I would buy that product. Even if it was generic, a knockoff, whatever the case is, the two companies that, that I just will not buy uh, products from is Six Cents and the Zoom. I don't know why. Honestly, I don't, you know, I think it's because of Six Cents. You know, I remember when they were coming up and, and they were kind of building their, their products. And I watched a lot of their videos. And again, I, I, I know, again, not going to get into knockoffs and who knocks off who and who this and that. They all knock off each other. They're all similar. A, a, a lipless uh, crankbait is a lipless crankbait. There's, 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 every company makes them. It's, it, again, we, we, we get it. I, I get it. There's really nothing different from one versus the other. I don't know. There was a, it just... Is there certain things they were doing when they were coming up, it, it just kind of put a bad taste in my mouth. Uh, and again, I, I just, unfortunately for me, or maybe maybe it's unfortunate, maybe it's not unfortunate. I just, that's the company I want to pay. And Zoom, I, I tried their products. I, I really tried their products. And, you know, again, I know there's probably some guy, people out there who say, hey, Zoom's a great product. And it probably is. It just, for me, I, I would never buy a Zoom product. Um, that and the yum. I tried the yum worms, and I, again, I don't think I ever caught anything on there. I mean, Berkeley Power Bait worms, you check those out there, and you you catch a biggins after biggins, 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 biggins. You know, the, the zoom and the yums, I just, I, I really never caught anything. All right, so, you know, for me, again, I could buy, I, I could use a lot of different products. I buy a lot of different products. I, I, I really do kind of look for the new new thing or something that, that will work better for me in a situation that I fish, and I do try a lot of different a lot of different lures, um, you know, from a lot of different companies uh, and a lot of different brands. But for me, I would never buy going down, going down to Cabela's and, and, and they gave me a million dollar shopping spree and you could buy anything you want. It all had to be fishing and it all had to be related to largemouth bass. And you could basically buy whatever you want. The companies I wouldn't touch and, and, and again, free, even if somebody offered it to me free, I, I, I'd probably put it away. It would be Six Sense, Yum and Zoom. 
th th those are the three uh, in no particular order it just again for me it just wouldn't you know and somebody could come up to me and, and give me a package of, of yum worms or yum baits and i would just, uh, probably give it to my nephew or something like that I'd probably just throw it out in the garbage same thing with zoom at six cents but hey it's all personal preference all what's work it's all it's all it's all what you you know what works best for you um and again there's no right or wrong uh, answer to this and again i know there's gonna be a lot of people uh that says hey one versus the other and that's okay too so you know but that, that that's my opinion again if i'm going down the aisle i'm just not gonna i'm not gonna fish uh or i'm not gonna buy you know six cents again if it's not buying it i'm not buying yum and i'm not buying zoom so those are the three companies i i stay clear of um let me know what what, what companies you stay clear of I, I know we all have again we all have our favorite companies and we all have our favorite brands and the things that we love to fish and there's always that one or two brands yeah, you just go back and you go in the aisle and say, I'm not touching that with a 10-foot pole. So let me know. I, I, you know, again, there is no right or wrong answer. It's just we all have our own personal preference. And that's why there's so many companies out there. That's why there's so many companies. Out there. And this is not, this is a fraction of the companies that are out there. Um, and, you know, again, just let me know. And drop a comment below and i greatly appreciate it all right thanks for watching i greatly again i greatly appreciate anybody that subscribes or if you're following subscribe and you made it to this point i really do appreciate it and again don't forget about the rooster tail if you do fish a rooster tail let me know all right catch you next time getting it done fishing out